Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Rosanna. So in today, I almost forgot my name. Like, wait, what? Rosanna. It's my source, Rosanna. Um, yes. So in today's video, we are talking all about just casual everyday um, makeup, what I use every day on a normal basis when I am home. So um, yeah, that is what we're going to be talking about today, everyday makeup tutorial. But before we get into that video, I would love, love, love for you to subscribe to my channel. You can ring the bell. It will give you notifications of when I post, which is every Tuesday and every Saturday between one and two-ish. So yeah, like, make comments, ring the bell, tell your friends, subscribe, help a newbie out. I would so, so appreciate appreciate your support and thank you so so much for helping me grow this channel and if you want to take a look at my everyday makeup tutorial then just keep on watching okay cool so let me just put my hairdo back just so normally here's what i do normally i will um i only wash my hair i try to get away with washing my hair only once a week i just don't like and i just don't think it's healthy to um wash it every day i know like once a week is kind of pushing it but i try i try once a week i did pick up some um some dry shampoo not the dry shampoo the like little it's like little powder that goes in there i haven't used it yet but um i do try it maybe i'll do it twice a week but for the most part i really try to do it um once a week and then like i'll straighten it then the next day i'll just throw curls in so like i'll just throw curls in and these will last me like you know you know three four days maybe anyways yeah so that's uh that's what i do with my hair do let me just put my uh, light here so what i do what i have on my face right now is just uh, i don't even have moisturizer on i have been i started to use um some niacinamides and vitamin c and um q10 so that's what i have on my face today my tried and true of the love of all my life let me just put my light on here so i could see i'm gonna bring it super de duper close because i can't see so you're gonna have this you're gonna see that this is my ricky this is my ricky skinny which i love so let's see what i can do here let me just yeah that's good okay cool and you know the light's gonna reflect but you know it's a casual day it is so freaking gloomy out and um but i'm okay with it i love gloomy days you know it gives me excuse you know to eat potato chips girl um to be in my pajamas all day um you know to read a book and you know take naps three four times a day but anyway whatever so it's a gloomy day i adore i adore adore this cerave hydrating sunscreen sheer tint spf 30 there you go i love this stuff i it is so to, to me personally um it is so emollient and creamy i don't even use a moisturizer um when i have this on so it blends seamlessly into skin lightweight not greasy feel um three essential cinnamides and niacinamides it is beautiful so i i mean it is messy blah blah yeah, it is so amazing so i'm going to just throw some on my face a rooney and i like i said most of the time i don't even put a moisturizer on it is so beautiful now sometimes going on it looks very oh it's so pretty like going on sometimes it, it looks very um what's what i'm looking for very glowy so if any of you guys have like um oily skin this may not be for you ish i love it like it's it's so good to me personally i love i will put it all the way like underneath my eye on my eyelids and i don't even use um concealer on my casual days i just do not use concealer it is so beautiful i will um that's gonna be my background he's gonna be barking someone's moving in in the neighborhood and you know he's not a people person he's his own kind of person person so as you could see it is very very emollient do i feel like i want to put on a little bit more no i think i'm good actually i want to put a little bit down my neck just because it's gloomy out girl does not mean that you do not need your sunscreen even though i just said i'm bringing it down my neck i figured i'll put some more on it's so pretty so anyway every time i wear this which is not every day i do work three days a week i'm an or nurse and um on those days that I go to work, not gonna lie, I don't have time. It, it this needs time to set in and to seep into the skin. Girl, I ain't got time for that in the morning. I I do not even. Mm -mm, I don't even have time. Like if I have to go to the bathroom, I'm gonna be late. Um, I just so on the days that I work, I just don't have the physical time to uh, allow this to seep in. Anyway, look how beautiful. So during the course of the day, like I, if I'm running my errands, like sometimes like I'll like, you know, touch my skin. Like it is so friggin' soft. It feels so doggone good. So that's basically what I do um, on an everyday basis. I just have my delicious 
tinted sunblock it's so so delicious so i'm going to just let this seep in for a little bit like 10 20 minutes and um then we will come back with just my everyday casual makeup okay cool so recently and this is just a recent um routine um i picked up this uh l'oreal true match nude hyaluronic tinted serum um it is so beautiful the first time i used it i was like this i couldn't figure out this feels kind of like well, yes it feels like a serum that is the word i was trying to figure out i'm like this feels different so i've been just putting this on just a little little bit like i have a lot of hyperpigmentation here you know and there are days when i'm like well, i really don't care and then there are days that i you know i do care so this is the only thing is it's very very messy very messy so it does say to put it on with your hands so that is exactly what i do i'm going to just take it like just like this it's so messy though just like that and i'm going to just yeah it feels the first time i use it i'm like this feels i wanted to say oh this feels wet um yeah girl of course it feels wet but that's the word i was looking for it feels very creamy it's a it feels exactly what it is it feels like a serum it's so nice i will take this all the way underneath my eyes because um on my days home every day i do not wear concealer so i'm gonna just rub this in on my eyelids i take it all over it's so friggin pretty i mean isn't that gorgeous and it feels so good. That's what it is. Not only does it look good, it feels so good. Mm. Okay, this looks so, so good. And it feels good. Let me just move my mirror um, over there. And yeah, let's get down to business. First and foremost, do not judge the sister. They're filthy. Do not judge. Um, I use this almost every day, especially on my days that I'm working. Most of these products I have um, right on my vanity. I love, love, love the Hula bronzer. Who doesn't love the Hula bronzer? This is just the original, I guess. So gorgeous. I mean, look at that. I, I, um, I almost want to, you see that dent in there? I have to be hitting pan somewhere down there. I wear this all the time. It is so, so simple. Um, who doesn't love it? And it's so beautiful. Like it leaves, you know how like some bronzers kind of like you could tell you have a bronzer on this this to me look at my hairs all over this to me feels like it just blends right into the skin you'd like yes you could see it's on but when you look super de duper close on the skin it doesn't look like you have makeup on if that makes any kind of sense that is so beautiful i'm gonna go super de duper high on into the hairline i like to put any kind of blush bronzer contour over the bridge of my nose that is so beautiful I'm gonna go underneath my chinny chin chin, right? Take it down. I have like my microphone like right over here, like pinned like right here. So sometimes when I go across, you can hear like the rubbing. So if you do, I apologize, but it is, ooh, look how pretty that is. It looks so beautiful. Okay, love, love, love this dog on Hula bronzer. My favorite in the whole wide world, love that. Um, same thing. I'm, I, I, you know, I always said, why don't I ever talk about my everyday products that literally are just sitting there? And I don't know why. Like I never, I don't know. I don't even know if I've ever done a video on that. But you know, here we are. This is what we're going to do today. So this is the physician's formula blush that I wear almost every day. This is the blushing berry multicolored blush. It is so so beautiful. I love these multicolor blushes. I think they're so pretty. And then it comes with like a cute little mirror. But who uses that? I didn't even know there was one there. And of course, it had like a powder puff there. But I don't use that either. So I'm gonna just put um, a little bit of blusheroni on. So so nice. I am a pinky mauvey girl. Ooh, this is so beautiful. Over the bridge. Look how nice that is. So so nice. You know, very casual, very light love 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 that thank you very very much and then of course i know this is like a papau highlighter i know this is the benefit cookie i know i know it's a papau wow. and it's not really casual but to me it is like to me it's a casual it's a casual highlighter but you know everybody's everybody's definition of casual is you know different so but i love 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 this highlighter i mean everybody knows it it is so blinding but i'm just happy but i just want to show you i know i know i feel like i'm contradicting myself casual and this is like but here a sister out here a sister out 
but do you see how like the whole skin is glowing like the whole face is glowing and this is just like a little extra unless you want to go extra you know what i'm trying to say girl you could absolutely use this as a casual just have like a lighter hand Ooh, that is so pretty my face looks so healthy i love that um yeah so that is everything on the face and i mean i i just recently probably about six months ago started doing my eyebrows and um any old eyebrow product will do i just happened to grab the precisely my brow from benefit that i really 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 like and um it's just i i have pretty good eyebrows to begin with i just fill them in like where i feel like i need to like to fill them in like you see like right over here like right over here they're a little bit light there but other than that like i don't go full for it not that i ever have but it's not like i go um like full force on like a whole you know night out eyebrow we kind of girl kind of look i'll just fill them in over here just a filling it's not like i want to um give myself like the whole you know contoured full fluffy partridge in a pear tree kind of eyebrow i'm just you know just filling them in very casual very cute so that's what i do for my eyebrows if you have to wear like a concealer like you have to like i normally go for any of the maybelline age rewind this one is in neutralizer i mean like so right now i think it looks super super nice you know how like when you just have like let's just say like this kind of look on and i said well let me just put on a little concealer it just looks like makeup on a non makeup -y kind of look if that makes sense does that make sense but let's just try it i'm going to just dab a little bit right over here on my hand so that's what i grabbed very very tiny 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 bit and just to brighten it up let's just see i barely look i just so i barely like touched it but just to like brighten it up a little bit let's just yeah if you want to do that i mean if you absolutely have to i mean can you really tell the yeah i'm going to take it back can you really tell the this i mean tiny tiny bit if you want to do that that's great i mean sometimes i do sometimes i don't but you know while we're here chit-chatting we might as well so i just put a tiny tiny bit right in the hollows right over there and um it still looks it still looks super super natural oh that looks so good I, I freaking i freaking love i love 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 the face it looks so good and healthy and glowy now um yeah so that's it eyeshadow girl most of the times i'll just throw on the bronzer just to give a little bit of color but today i figured i'd basically kind of do the same thing but this is the um this is the charlotte tilbury this is her eyes to mesmerize pot eyeshadows so this one is in sunset rose it is so beautiful isn't that gorgeous and i'm talking like a swipe like i just barely touched it look at that look how much came off of there so i'm going to just put it on my oh look how gorgeous isn't that beautiful it's so stinking subtle i'm going to just put this on my eyelid and i'm going to just shear it out and i'm going to just shear it out with my finger and pull it out right over here man that is so beautiful and how simple was that i'm gonna go again with my other hand i'm not a lefty but you know i feel like i can't get in the corners with my like when i go across doing the same exact thing just grabbing some product and then i'm just shearing it out with my finger and i'm just pulling it i'm gonna just pull it all the way to my eyebrow here so pretty now because i have hooded eyes because i have hooded eyes i just like to do a little bit extra right on my brow bone right over here so you could see a little bit i'm not looking to get like oh papau kind of color on my eyelid not at all because this is my casual day so i'm going to do the same thing on the other side just a little bit on the brow bone and then i'm going to shear it out i'm going to shear this bad boy out isn't that beautiful? I don't know if, if it's showing on there like it is on here. It is so... Wow, my face is glowing. It looks so beautiful. So that is that. Sometimes I'll throw like a little bit underneath my eyes, but I'm looking for a casual look. Sometimes. And if you want to, like for an example, let me just give you like a quick example. Like 
um, grab like one of these kind of these flat brushes right here. This is the BK Beauty 206. Not like a super like um, dense one. Do I have one over here? Let me see here. Yeah. Not like a super dense one, like the refer, like either one will do, but I'm saying like this one is very, very like dense. I just want to fluff it out. So what I do is, if you want to, I mean, we might as well. I'm going to just take some of the bronzer. I'm going to pinch my brush and I'm just going to go underneath. And I'm going to come close to you. You can barely, barely see the difference, but a little bit if you want to do that. You don't have to. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. It all depends like what kind of mood I'm in. And that's it. Oh man, I'm loving, loving, loving this. Actually, I'm going out later on just to watch my niece, um, who's a freshman, by the way. Congratulations, Isabel. I call her Isabu Boo. And anyway, she just got onto the um the um the freshman volleyball team. So she's got a game later on that I'm gonna go see her. So nice and casual. We're not sitting getting there, we're not sitting getting all glammed up for a dog on um volleyball game. So that is that. I'm gonna just curl my eye I curl my eyelashes. To me, you have a little bit of blush, a little lip gloss, and a mascara. You're good to go, girl. You're good to go. So basically, we're doing that with just a little bit of something extra, extra. So I'm going to just um, curl my eyelashes. Love this eyelash curl. It's from Refer. I recently picked up this e.l.f. Lash It Out, Lash It Loud Volumizing Mascara. I've had this in a few videos. If I remember which ones they are, I will link it below. It is so damn good. So I'm gonna just put like a nice little coat of mascara. Okay, how cute is that? I love that like when you do your lower lashes with not, with not like a lot of smudging and smoking, that it gives you like that cute little nice like baby doll open eye kind of effect. I think it's so pretty. Ooh. I think it's so, so pretty. And then last but not least, I'm gonna go in with like a, a, like a light lip. I'm gonna just go in with the KKW Beauty Lip Liner. This is in 0.5 Nude. And I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just line the lip even though it's casual day, I still like to overline a little bit, fill in um, a little bit of the, I'm not going to fill in the whole lip um, altogether, but just enough. Okay, so I just filled this in a little bit, and then I'm going to take my finger, and I just want to smooth out like that harsh line. Isn't that pretty? That is so beautiful. You can even do your whole lip with it and leave it like that for a matte look. You could um, do that and put like a gloss over it. So that is what I'm gonna do. I just, I love like this. Um, this is the NARS, who the hell could see? This is the NARS Orgasm. This is the Lip Balm. I love this. I actually picked it up in a mini. I loved it so much that I went to, I went back and I picked up the full, the full one. Look at that. It's so delicious and so balmy. And it does give you like a little bit of color. Let me just let me just wipe this off here, and then let me just show you. It still gives you like a little of a little bit of color. Can you see that? Gives you a lit. There you go. A little bit of color. I love this, and it feels so good on the lips. So that is it. Let me just put my hairdo down, and um, yeah. And we'll finish off this video. Okay, guys. So this is it. This is my tutorial of just my everyday makeup. So um, what do you guys think? Let me take a quick little look. I think it looks... Ooh, I think it looks so, so beautiful. Just note to self, if you um, oily girls out there think that this is like a little bit too glowy, I think it's fabulous. But then again, um, I am 53. I have mature skin. I, it's not dry. It's, it's like normal, whatever that is. But I love like that dewy, like emollient kind of look i think it looks so pretty but if you um if you don't like that just powder just put some whatever your favorite powder is and you know do a matte look if you want with your powder but i think this came out so so pretty very casual but still beautiful i think it looks so so good the skin 
Mm, girl, I cannot say enough about the skin. The skin looks so healthy and so glowy. Isn't that so pretty? You have just enough makeup on that you feel comfortable. I mean, I really don't care personally myself. I mean, I will even go to food shopping with like, you know, my pajama pants on and uh, a moisturizer on. I, I, I don't care. But this is a beautiful, in my opinion, everyday casual look. Like I said, I'm going to go see my niece play volleyball. And it's perfect. I think it's perfect. What do you guys think? Leave me some comments below. Um, what do you think about these products? Do you have them? Do you like them? What is your everyday casual look? I'm curious. Um, guys, let me know. By the way, thank you so, so much um, for sharing your time with me. And as always, you guys, be good to each other, love each other, and have a great, great day. Bye.